Hey everyone, this is the Mighty Mighty going for a journey's playthrough. I'm going to play all of the games, starting with, well, the first one, of course. Yeah, I've been playing these for quite a while. Oh, I truly love them. So now it's time for another playthrough for me. It's been like I don't know, a year, year and a half before I played one last time. So yeah, I thought this might be a good idea. So yeah, let's get this started. I'll be trying not to talk uh, over any videos or cutouts or anything so you guys can follow on what's going on. Although most of you might know it, so I'll be shutting up now and let you guys hear what the hell is going on. The Chantry teaches us that it is the hubris of men which brought the Darkspawn into our world. The mages had sought to usurp heaven, but instead, they destroyed it. They were cast out, twisted and cursed by their own corruption. They returned as monsters, the first of the darks. They became a blight upon the lands, unstoppable and relentless. The Dwarven Kingdoms were the first to fall, and from the deep roads, the Dark Spawn drove at us again and again, until finally we neared annihilation. Women from every race, warriors and mages, barbarians and kings. The Grey Warden sacrificed everything to stem the tide of darkness and prevail. been four centuries since that victory, and we have kept our vigil. We have watched and waited for the Darkspawn to return. But those who once called us heroes have forgotten. We are few now, and our warnings have been ignored for too long. Seen with my own eyes what lies on the horizon. Maker, help us all. So, yeah, this premises does not look too good. We're already knee deep in shit and I've not even started the game. So, I'll be doing this, I'll be rolling the dice to figure out what kind of character I'm gonna play. So, uh, even is for women, uh, uneven is for men. Uneven, man, good. I'm usually playing guys. Race. Uh, elf, great. Nope, that's not, yeah, elf, great. Class. Uh oh, Elven Mage. This is not gonna suck. Alright, cool. So I'll be a little magic building pussy. That's going to be absolutely awesome. Everyone hates me, and yay! Greetings. Hey, what's up, man? What are you gonna look like? Are you gonna look like Drake the Elf? 
I don't think so. Um, I don't know. God. Is this the what's that solace? Fuck off. Alright. Uh fine, it's just I might actually be skipping this, so you guys don't have to sit through this crap. Yeah. His name's Muddy. <laughs> oh yeah. Yes, magic, well power, don't need that. Might need a bit of cunning and strength is a little waste of any willpower, but I think it's a shit. A little bit of constitution, I guess. Mm. Yeah, we just take it. Oh, I don't know. That might be actually be very handy. I want to be able to do some damage, which might be a grand idea. That one's really annoying, so I take that one. I'm not into all this crap, like creation entropy. I don't know. I never really played around with it. Might I might do that for this one. That's just a normal. I got nothing proof. On the cliff I don't care. Overlooking the dark waters of Lake Kalanhad stands Great. the tower fortress that is home to the Circle of Magi. Oh yeah. This tower is the only place in Ferelden where mages may study their art among others of their kind. Within the high stone walls, the Circle practices its magic and trains apprentices in the proper use of their powers. But the Circle Tower is as much a prison as a refuge. The ever-vigilant Templars of the Chantry watch over all mages, constantly alert for any sign of corruption. This gilded cage is the only world you know. Found to be sensitive to magic at a young age, you were torn from your family and grafted here as an apprentice. Now, that apprenticeship is nearly over. All that remains is the final test, the harrowing. Magic exists to serve man, and never to rule over him. Thus spoke the prophet Andraste as she cast down the Tevinta Imperium, ruled by mages who had brought the world to the edge of ruin. Your magic is a gift, but it's also a curse. For demons of the dream realm, the Fade, are drawn to you and seek to use you as a gateway into this world. This is why the harrowing exists. The ritual sends you into the Fade, and there you will face a demon, armed with only your will. Now this is me, Muddy the freaking elf wizard. Or mage if you want. Um, training in this tower for ages. Like, it's gonna be a horrible study environment. Like this big burly dudes with that clad and steel just waiting for you to make a mistake to lop off your head. So yeah, he's not he's not stressed at all. I'm gonna go in there and probably get mind fucked by a demon. So this is a it's just a great day. Uh yeah. There is tranquility. Okay, never mind. Is losing all your magic an option. Might be. No. I have faith that you will succeed. Oh thank you, I'm just no gonna go apprentice. Okay. If you fail, we Templars will perform our duty. You will die. Okay, cool. So this is Lily, yeah. the very essence of magic, and your gateway into the Fade. The harrowing is a secret out of necessity, child. Every mage must go through this trial by fire. As we succeeded, so shall you. Keep your wits about you, and remember, the Fade is a realm of dreams. The spirits may rule it, but your own will is real. The apprentice must go through this test alone, first enchanter. You are ready. He screwed. <laughs> so, okay, guys, I'll just go talk to Satan. All right, okay, it's fine. 
Please don't do weird things to my body while I'm away. It's gonna be freaking weird with all those like dick pics on my freaking face. Ah. Well, whatever. So yeah, here we go. Standard disturbing statue. Yay. So this is actually the realm of God that they completely messed up, like lore wise. And I'm already screwing around like a complete retard, so that's okie dokie. Yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it, I got it. It's gonna be fine. Okay, that thing? Yeah, you got it. Oh cool, I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm um, okay, so he He's gonna sissy punch it. Ah bro. Seriously? <laughs> I'm gonna sissy punch things to death, but no, this is gonna suck. This one is okay, spray tag. Okay. This place is not completely creepy, that's right. Back to the sissy punching. It's a great comeback. Right, fall back, not come back. Come back. Basic mage, don't hit things because you can't. You're Someone else thrown to the wolves, as fresh and unprepared as ever. It isn't right that they do this, the Templars. Not to you, me, anyone. Oh, so this fucktard actually got lost near a is it rat. You're talking you rat. You think you're really here in that body? You look like that because you think you do. Okay. It's always the same, but it's not your fault. You're in the same boat I was, aren't you? We're not in a boat. Allow me to welcome you to the fade. You can call me. Well, mouse. Ten points for creativity, you fucked hard. Uh. No, I don't remember anything from before. Oh, that's creepy. The Templars kill you if you take too long, you see. They figure you failed, and they don't want something getting out. Mm -hmm. That's what they did to me, I think. I think. <laughs> no body to reclaim. And you don't have I'm not sure. This might have been a joke. End up the same. <laughs> yeah, the same. Okay, what am I supposed to do? There's something here contained, just for an apprentice like you. You have to face the creature, a demon, and resist it. If you can, that's your way out. Or your opponents, if the Templars wouldn't kill you. A test for you, a tease for the creatures of the Fade. The creatures of the Fade. Okay, so. Anything can die. That is, it's, it's as simple as that. Why pitching is such a creature? I don't understand why this test is so feared. Why pitch me? For those in the tower, maybe you'll be lucky enough to ask. Maybe someday, so will I. Mm. There are others here, other spirits. They will tell you more. Okay. Maybe help if you can believe anything you see. Okay. I'll follow if that's all right. My chance was long ago. But you, you may have a way out. So what you're telling me is, Lyra... The dangerous spirit is not far. Uh -huh. Don't go near it unless you're ready to fight. Not far. I'm gonna take that warning seriously and just kind of ignoring it. So what he's telling me is that Lyra is actually LSD and I'm tripping balls right now. That's great. I'm laying up there shitting myself and I'm in a magic realm. Okay. That. No. I'm not gonna go near that. That looks like it's evil. I'm just gonna spend some other things. Grand. Didn't even prepare me for this. Okay, I'm gonna check this out. What the hell is this? Spirit of Valor. Oh yeah. Ah, it's a Templar. Another spirit this way. It never seemed equal to its name to me. Oh, you're following me. Cool. Okay. That's my pet rat. 
mouse. mortal thrown into the flames and left to burn, I see. Yep. Your mages have devised a cowardly test. Better you were pitted against each other to prove your mettle with skill, than to be sent unarmed against a demon. But fight you with no warriors and no shit. They would have you battle a demon. With magic or weapon, to be the victor makes you a warrior still. Okay. That you remain means you have not yet defeated your hunter. I wish you a glorious battle to come. Thanks, but I need your help. Of course. You are not the first mortal to seek my aid. Okay. I am not here to assist you, however. My purpose is to seek perfection. Creating the ultimate weapon for the pursuit of valor. You had a few, few uh, flying swords behind you there, dude. Uh, might affect the demon. A doubt. In this realm, everything that exists is the expression of a thought. Okay. Do you think these blades be steel? The staves be wood? Do you believe they draw blood? No. A weapon is a single need for battle. And my will makes that need reality. Uh huh. Do you truly desire one of my weapons? Yes. I will give one to you, if you agree to duel me first. Valor shall test your metal as it should be tested. Ah, great. So, I might actually be killed. Could I try my willpower? You seem to prefer to kill me yourself. How dare you accuse me? I am no demon preying upon helpless mortals to steal their essence. I am a being of honor and valor. I am a warrior. Fair enough, fair enough. And prove it, help me find demon. You are insolent. But your will is unquestionably strong. Ha <laughs> ha, got him. Very well, mortal. You proved to me that you possess the strength to resist this demon. No, I didn't. Go. Prove your worth as you must. I am confident you will succeed. Sweet. I got something. What the hell did I get? Well, a staff. There's the F. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, no, nothing. Fair. We're going on here. Okay. So. Breath alert. So you can actually talk your way out of this crap. Test, test. I say thank goodness for the freaking staff. I don't have to sissif fight people to death. There is another spirit. No, it's not. I know. Ah, sloth demon. It's a lazy bastard, isn't it? Isn't that what it is? I think so. Ah, it's sleeping. So, you are the mortal being hunted. And the small one? Is he to be a snack for me? Oh, that'd be great. I don't like this. He's not going to help us. We should go. No matter. The demon will get you eventually. And perhaps there will even be scraps left. You. So you're talking about eating me. Great. It's a demon. Maybe even more powerful than the one chasing after you. Be gone. Surely you have better things to do than bother sloth, mortal. Oh, I tire of you already. Sloth? Really? Okay. You have a very nice staff. Thank you. <laughs> Why do you need me? Go. Use your weapon since you have. Be valorous. Suck it, give me something. He looks powerful. It might be possible that he could teach you to be like him. Like uh. me? You mean teach the mortal to take this form? <laughs> why? Yeah, why? Most mortals are too attached to their forms to learn the change. You, on the other hand, little one, might be a better student. You let go of the human form, 
Years ago. Uh, okay. I don't think I'd make a very good bear. How would I hide? Is that a bear? I thought it was an ugly dog. It's true. I am quite powerful in this form. When I wish to be. That's great. I welcome the opportunity, if it is my choice. The mages in the tower are quick to volunteer others, as you well know. Yes. I'll try. I'll try to be a bear, if you'll teach me. That's nice. But teaching is so exhausting. Away with you now. So you want to learn to be a big hairy homosexual? Great. I told you he wasn't going to help us. Do you wish to learn my form, little one? Oh then no, I, I hate this. challenge for your friend. Answer three riddles correctly, and I will teach you. Fail, and I will devour you both. The decision is yours. I can't think about it. Riddles, uh, fuck me, yeah, fine. Mm -hmm. oh. Well, this gets more and more promising. Does it now? My first riddle is this. I have seas with no water, coasts with no sand, towns without people, mountains without land. What am I? Sea with no water, coast with no... Uh, yeah, a map. That's fucking genius. <laughs> Brilliant. I love it. Let's move on. The second riddle. I'm rarely touched, but often held. Yeah. If you have wit, you'll use me well. What am I? Wisdom? Ah, oh, tongue. Yeah. It's a tongue. Yes, your witty tongue. <laughs> Fair enough. One more try. I'm here patting my own back, they're not very hard. Spin the tail, never will I charge you free. I'll amuse you an entire eve. But, alas, you won't remember me. What am I? Spin a tail, charge a fee. Use you for an entire eve. But that you won't remember me. A dream? Oh yeah, it's a dream. You are correct, brother. It's like the only thing you don't remember. And proven yourself an amusing distraction. So, I shall teach you my form. Now, listen carefully. Like this? Am I a bear? It feels heavy. You're a bear, dude. Mm -hmm. Close enough. Go then, man. Defeat your demon or whatever you intend to do. I grow weary of your mortal prattling. Cool. Very cool. Let's go back. So, we should have all the advantages we can get. Like, pretty much. <coughs> That's interesting. Hello, hello. Damage than that freaking bear. Shimmering orb of light. That's gonna be helpful. Ah, at least he can, he's gonna be able to see when he kicks my ass. It's gonna be great. Uh, I wonder if this is where Satan sleeps. Uh, what the hell did he do? And there is a spirit of rage. Rage. And so it comes to me at last. Hey, bro. What are Soon you? I shall see the land of the living with your eyes, creature. You shall be mine, body and soul. Creepy. This is against fun. You may want to find us both. Amusing. Have you not told it of all arrangement, Mouse? We don't have an arrangement. Not anymore. Oh. 
And after all those wonderful meals we have shared, you ate people. Now suddenly the mouse has changed the rule. I'm a fish-eating mouse. Uh. I'm not a mouse now, and soon I won't have to hide. I don't need to bargain with you. Nice. We shall see. We shall see. I know. When you came, I hoped that maybe you might be able to, but I never really thought any of you were worthy. Uh, <laughs> okay. The ones who betrayed you before. They were not as promising as you. It was a long time ago. Uh, I don't remember their names. I don't even remember my own name. It's the Fade and the Templars killing me, like they tried with you. Great. You me. defeated a demon. You completed your test. With time, you will be a master enchanter with no equal. Yeah, I'm shooting a little high. I was hoping that for someone as small and as forgotten as me. If you want to help, sure there do. may be a way for me to leave here, to get a foothold outside. You just need to want to let me in. No, he's the, he's the demon. He's the main demon. No. What? What are you? Of course it was. What else is here? Look at Harmon and Prentice of your potential. a little bastard, isn't he? <laughs> you are a smart one. Thank you. Simple killing is a warrior's job. Okay, just check myself. The real dangers of the fade are preconceptions, careless trust, crime. <laughs> Okay, thanks. Bye, Satan. I'm not screwed right now. Are you all right? Say something, please. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. They carried you in this morning. I didn't even realize you'd been gone all night. I've heard about apprentices who never come back from Harrowings. Is it really that dangerous? What was it like? Is that why they don't tell us what it's about? I know I'm not supposed to know, but we're friends. Just a little hint and I'll stop asking, I promise. Really? That's it? That makes sense. They want to see if you can resist a demon and stop yourself from becoming an abomination. Mm -hmm. And now you get to move to the nice mage's quarters upstairs. I'm stuck here and I don't know when they'll call me for my harrowing. Easy for you to say. Yeah, excuse me there, that was just my wife. Had. Sometimes I think they I'm just right don't back. want to test me. The Tranquil never go through a harrowing. You do the harrowing, the rite of tranquility, or you die. That's what happens. They might not, but the rite of tranquility is just as bad, maybe worse. You've seen the Tranquil around the tower, like Owain who runs the stockroom. Yeah. He's so cold. No, not even cold. It's no, just it's like Spock. Nothing it's in just him. worse. It's like he's dead but still walking. His voice, his eyes lifeless yeah like Trump when he's talking just talking he's been made tranquil I don't know how they do it exactly but you're cut off from the fate it takes away your magic abilities along with your dreams and emotions the fade is the dream realm maybe it's a side effect of being cut off from the fade no dreams, no emotions. Apprentices can ask to be made tranquil if they fear the harrowing. 
But the circle also forces tranquility on those they feel are weak. And sometimes they force it upon apprentices they think might be too dangerous as mages. I shouldn't waste your time with this. I was supposed to tell you to see Irving as soon as you woke up. You better not keep him waiting. We can speak later. Did you hear anything? So this is what we'll is he all right? make today. Is he awake? Why do you care? Oh, Are you video. just friends now? I'm just curious. Mm -hmm. That Templar Cullen said it was the quickest, cleanest harrowing he'd ever seen. He must